the ditch. Daniel Sharp, swimmer with disability. What's your disability, Daniel? Uh, I'm an S13, which is um, visually impaired, so I have very limited vision. Okay, so that qualifies you now so far in the Arafura Games. A couple of gold, a couple of silver. Uh, yeah, no, last night I had the uh, 100 freestyle and the gold freestyle. And, um, yeah, they were well, gold and 100 and silver and 50. So, please, please get yeah, how that went. Are you just a freestyle or do you mix some rest? Uh, I do freestyle as well, so tonight I've got the uh, 100 freestyle. Uh, so. Now, rumour has it, Daniel Sharp, that you're out to break the world record in the 50 breaststroke, but it stands at 31.79. What are your chances? Um, my PB is just outside the record of 32.1, so um, hopefully I get to start the night and just keep the time to see How much more difficult is it swimming outside in these conditions at the Casuarina pool where you've got the, the wind and perhaps a, a little bit of wash against you. Records would be hard to get. Yeah, it does play a difference. There's not too much breeze actually down at the pool. Um, so it's not too bad. And the pool's good itself, so it should be interesting. Do you do it much outdoor swimming? I uh, know, it's, it's too cold back home. <laughs> it's all outdoors and too wet, so no, it's all, all our mix back home all indoors and stuff, so it's different being outdoors. And do you get a lot of competition with, with your disability in New Zealand? Um, not with other disability swimmers, but I train for the Able Body Squad and I compete in our Able Body Squad. So that's how I get my competition. Is Beijing unrealistic for you? Uh, no, not at all. Beijing is my Lane three, Gio, Lane four, Melody Thompson, New Zealand. Lane five, Melody Thompson, New Zealand. Lane five, Melody Thompson, New Zealand. Lane five, Melody now with the qualifying time, when they come out, do you actually have to achieve that in competition or do you do it in a pool in, in someone's backyard? Um, it probably will be in competition, um, not too sure because that's what they're sort of revamping the whole way they're doing that qualifying so they're going to release all those the times and where or when we have to do the qualifying times and stuff so we'll find it out in a month or so. What do you know in terms of competition, uh, na international competition between now and Beijing? What have you got to plan? Um, I've got world champs um, in Brazil, mine world, world in Brazil, um, July this year. So that's my main event for this year, it's all their target thing. In the water, it's the next 73, the girls 13 to 14, 50 meters back, straight heat four, in lane one, Georgia for Queen. Daniel Sharp, 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 New Zealand, Queensland, disabled swimmer. How do you find out about the form of other swimmers that with your disability, people that you're up against and you did a ranking or you ranked it? Yeah, there is a ranking system. Lane 7, Frank Walker, Western Australia. Lane 8, Kate Jordan, Queensland. I'm against other swimmers. I don't worry about it too much, just focus on my own time to be in fast and we'll see where that puts me when I turn up to be yeah. Well done, good luck for tonight and let's hope the world record is broken at the Arafura 2007. Yeah, hopefully. Thank you very much. Cheers.